This stone structure is over 2,000 years old. Yet even today, its scale shocks historians. It fed thousands of monks. Every single day. No machines. No modern technology. So how was this even possible? At the Abha Yajuri Temple, the colossal bath Orwa, a 19-meter stone rice trough, did just that. Alongside the Kanda Orwa for curries, this was the world's first mega buffet, an extraordinary feat of faith, engineering, and community life. Let's step into a golden age that still echoes through the ruins of Anuradhapura and Abhayajari. With over 2,500 years of history, Sri Lanka is a land of timeless wonder, where the legacy of ancient ancestors lives on through breathtaking marvels that still leave us in awe today. As you walk through the ancient ruins of Anuradhapura, you step into the heart of Sri Lanka's first kingdom, a civilization far ahead of its time. With advanced hydraulic systems, towering stupas, and vast temple complexes, these ruins tell the story of an era shaped by Buddhism and greatness. Once home to thousands of monks, equipped with everything from hospitals to refectories, Anuradhapura still echoes with the spirit of a golden age that changed the destiny of a nation. In the Anuradhapura Kingdom Abhayajari Temple Complex, the largest of Sri Lanka's ruined monasteries. Founded in the 1st century BC by King Valagamba and gifted to the monk Mahatissa of Kapikala, Abhayajari sprawled across nearly 200 hectares. Over time, it became the seat of Mahayana Buddhism, home to more than 5,000 monks, surpassing even the famed Mahavihara. At its heart, the main refectory featured the colossal bath Orwa, a 19-meter-long stone rice trough, and the Kanda Orwa for curries. Modern studies reveal that the Bath Orwa alone could feed nearly 5,800 monks daily, a staggering scale of communal dining unmatched in the ancient world. This was more than a kitchen, it was an engineering marvel and a testament to the organizational brilliance of the time. These ancient alms halls were more than just dining spaces, they were centers of community, spirituality, and innovation. Inscriptions like the Mahintail tablets recorded rules for monks and staff, including wardens and cooks, reflecting a society that valued structure and devotion. The monumental stone troughs, water systems, and vast refectories reveal a civilization that combined faith, engineering, and generosity on an extraordinary scale. Even today, walking among the ruins of Abhayajari and Anuradhapura, you can feel the spirit of a civilization far ahead of its time, a society that combined faith, ingenuity, and generosity to create marvels that still inspire awe. These were not just monasteries, they were living legacies, feeding both bodies and souls. If you're fascinated by ancient wonders and lost civilizations, subscribe to Uncharted History and hit the bell to uncover more secrets from Sri Lanka's extraordinary past. Join us as we continue exploring the mysteries of history, one marvel at a time.